Hello all, welcome to my space again. So as all of you were asking me about uh, which company you you have joined, basically I have joined EPAM Systems. I got the opportunity on campus itself. I'm share, I am here to share my interview experience of EPAM System with you all as EPAM is hiring a huge number of freshers this year. So it will be helpful for you all and not uh, as they had conducted their on campus but they are releasing some more uh, drives um, by the different names like sadka program for 2023 and 2024 graduates uh, so i think this interview experience will help you a lot not only the 2025 graduates but 2022 and 2020 2023 and 2025 uh, four graduates so let's start uh, about my interview experience so before starting the, my interview experience, I want to tell about the whole recruitment process of EPAM systems. EPAM system is first round is of online assessment as we all know. In online assessment it consists of uh, MCQs which is related to English, Grammar, uh, CN, OOPS, DBMS, uh, some DSA questions, MCQs. And there are two coding questions, two DSA coding questions. Uh, the uh, the exam is conducted on their own coded platform. Uh, the question was of easy to medium level, basic easy to lead code, uh, easy to medium level lead code problems. The question was from uh, array and strings. After yeah, so this is a, if you clear the online assessment, then you will call for the technical uh, interview. In technical interview, um, first of all how the process was uh, first of all he will see he or she who is whosoever is the interviewer he will see your performance in the online assessment basically if you have cheated in the online assessment they can see also because the exam is proctored and many of the candidates were caught also so they just review your performance in the exam in their laptops in front of you only after that uh, uh, this uh, then he asked me about my introduction after introduction he asked me about some translated questions as my uh, specialization in cyber security he asked me some cyber security related questions then after that he asked me about my project then after project he wanted me to write a code as he provided me a scenario he wanted me to write a code in Java related to my project itself and using try catch block. So he provided me five minutes of time. I coded it up within that uh, frame of time. Then he asked me two DSA questions uh, on array and string. Uh, it was also an easy to medium level question, I will say. Then he asked me basic OOPS concepts. Then, uh, yeah. Then he moved to some HR related questions that after uh, five years, where do you see yourself and these kind of questions. Uh, at that moment, he was satisfied enough, I think. I believe basically. Then this was, uh, yeah, the interview lasted for 45 minutes to one and a half. Uh, this is all about the technical part. The major hurdle was the technical part, I would say. The HR is, will go smoothly. In HR, uh, when you clear the uh, technical round uh, within five minutes they will say whether you have passed the technical round or not then you move to hr round uh, hr round they will provide you a sheet you have to fill that more frequently frequently kind of questions uh, you will do at uh, that period of time only then the hr just uh, asked about normal questions you will able to clear it not a big deal so this is all about the epam systems uh, technical plus hr questions which i faced in my interview experience and the interview experience will uh, depend from candidate to candidate and the interview to interview so you don't have control over it so give your best shot and i would say be confident if the interview is not going towards uh, as you wanted to go so clean up your mind and stay at that uh, a state of mind that you can track the interviewer in your own path i will say that's the major crux to clear any interview and i will say uh, to get more updates uh, stay connected with me i will provide much more interview experience of my other fellow um, 
other fellow college mates which uh, recent interview experience on campus experience and off campus so see you soon thank you